We begin this half hour with breaking news in Nightdale. A man is in custody after police say he stabbed his co-worker to death. Thanks for sticking with us. I'm Lena Tillette. And I'm Dan Haggerty. Officers were originally responding this morning to a fight at a business. You see it on the map off Spectrum Drive. WRL's Aaron Thomas arrived at the scene a short time ago. Aaron, you're just learning now the name of this business. What else can you tell us? Yeah, that's correct, Dan. In fact, um, making sure the micro microphone was on. But anyway, yeah, we just learned within the past five, 10 minutes or so, uh, Cormark appears to be the business that's impacted. We've actually been driving around this industrial park for the past hour or so. You can actually see one of the fences is actually marked with uh, orange uh, crime tape of sorts. We've seen a lot of activity. Uh, walking through that door, there's actually a sign that said uh, closed for the day. And then within the past five minutes, we actually had an attorney representing the business coming out. She actually asked us to come back tomorrow, but I said that this is something that we're covering tonight. So uh, certainly a lot of uh, big developments uh, happening in this particular story. I want you to take a look at your screen. This is some of the video that we've actually obtained uh, from a particular viewer um, that shows the large police presence uh, earlier this morning and you can actually see uh, somebody first responders uh, providing some medical attention to a person in need a uh, night police said that they responded to a fight in progress here on spectrum drive this morning and that's where they found 49 year old Delevious Tawan Gilbert suffering from stab wounds uh, he did die from his injuries at the hospital and police do believe that this altercation stem from some uh, earlier uh, disagreements that happened on Monday. Now, I have been uh, reaching out to both the Nightdale police chief as well as the Wake County district attorney. Both of them are working in connection on this investigation. We're pushing them for more answers. Be sure to stay with us uh, for any new developments as they become available. Dan? Let us know what you find out, Aaron. Reporting live. Thanks.